Oh. Yes, I am. We are going down to mm. Bet365 Stadium. Get coach up to Barnsley. Barnsley. And hopefully we can get a win because of recent it has been absolutely do -do. It's been shit. So um, hopefully we can get a win. And um, yeah, we're going to go Mackey's get something because we are starting. <laughs> McDonald's, but we've reached a problem. They only received chip and pin at the minute. They're only doing contactless. So, as my card is a contactless. Yeah, my card ain't either. So, that's no food for him. I've already eaten. Six five stadium. Used to be the stadium. Yep. Yeah, Coaches are over there. Yes, just below, just below my we finger. Are on coach. If I can get the ticket. Eleven. I think it was. I think it's more than eleven. I think it's, it's either eleven or twelve. It's higher than that. We are on coach twenty. Fuck. We're taking a lot. Well then. There's some nice cars in here though. Yeah. And there's a lot of spaces there. Yeah, we've been cheeky. We've been cheeky. The exit is over there. So I we've think. Been cheeky. Yeah, so we got this. So let's get going, mate. Needed so um, Chester, Allen, and De Haney start. Uh, Thompson Brown also come back in the team. So playing a 5 3 2, 3 5 2, however you want to see it. Bonham keeps his place in net. Then you got Harwood Bell and Shaggy Alpha Chester, De Haney and Tyler as wing backs, Allen Baker, Thompson in midfield, and Brown and Madger up front. If you're wondering why we're so out of breath, it's because of how high up we've had to walk. Yeah, we're very unfit as well. We have Barnsley are lining up with a 4 2 3. Liam Kitchen replaces Matty Wolf and Jasper Moon comes back into the team. We've got a few good players in um, Bassey, Keena, Styles, uh, Anderson, Kellick and Colin. So it's a pretty solid team. Um, it's a shame that they are fighting for relegation, but um, they're going to play 4 through 3 So what's your take on the team, mate? The team, our team looks pretty strong. I've not seen Dehaney play yet, so this is the new one for me. He's played in the FA Cup and League Cups. Fair enough. So. But I think tonight we should be pretty good. Yeah. I think we're doing pretty aggressive tonight, aren't we? Yeah, we've got, we've got to, mate. We've got to go aggressive. Dehaney gets forward a lot more than Smith. Yeah. Who isn't even named on the bench. 
So, um, Hopefully, but I'm, I'm predicting 3-1. 3-1 too. Uh, well, it's good. It's good that we've got positivity around. I'm going for 2 1 Stoke, and um, if we do lose tonight, um, my Michael O'Neill's job is seriously at stake. I don't want him to go, he's a great man, but I'm starting to lean towards the Michael O'Neill out for grade, and I don't want that at all. We have got Oscar, and I've got a burger, and I've got a pie. Brian, a hot dog. where's your hot dog on? Here. Yeah. Right down there, we've got our drinks. So, it's quarter pounder, wasn't it? Quarter pound of cheeseburger. Quarter pound of cheeseburger from Barnsley. Let's 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 dig in. Because it's a nice touch of the brioche bun. Thoughts? There's one man. You know Chris Eubankers, don't you? Yes. You know what he would describe this as what? Well, absolutely stupendous confection. Isn't it? <laughs> it is brilliant, mate. That Good. is really nice. Really, really nice. Well, he got the burger, I got the hot dog. I've already had a bite, but... It's a, like, to be honest, the sausage tastes nice. Yeah. The bread is ready. Is it better than normal bread? It's northern. It's, it, well, it's pretty nice. It, I was going to say it's better than the one we had at... It's GPR in that. It's def, definitely better than the one we had at Hull. That was very disappointing. Yeah. Better than the one we had at Huddersfield. That was very disappointing. But this one, mate. This one's the best one I've had so far. Nice. That's um, good to hear, mate. Welcome to
was that? Yeah. Stupid. Stupid. Louis Baker is our saviour. Louis Baker is our saviour, so guys. Did it, again. it was... Really? First off, alright. Second off, fell apart a bit. The one thing I don't understand is Michael O'Neill playing defensive football against a team which are pretty much already relegated. Mm. We need to start, start playing, play, uh, playing aggressively. Yeah, we do. If, if, in order for something to actually come out of this season, we need to play aggressive. I don't know why, you know, DiMaggio is never in the team, so I don't know why he's playing a negative 5 for the 2. We should have gone for really aggressive. Yeah, we should have, we should have at least gone 4 2 3 1 or 4 3 3, mate. Exactly. It's annoying, and well, at least we got a point out of it. Yeah, and that, that is the thing. At least we managed to get a point, and many people might critique that at the moment. A point looks like the best we're going to get. But a point's a point at the end of the day. Peter, bro, needs to be a lot better. Yes, it does. Mate, we need a massive improvement, and then Cardiff, they're a bit just behind us. Cardiff are 17th, so... So they're just behind us. They're just behind us. So that'll be that'll be a tricky. That'll one, be I a think. test. It'll be a test for sure. But it, but Peterborough definitely needs to turn around, and we need a uh, hell of a lot better performance out of that. Like the one final thing I will say is we've had some amazing games this season. Obviously three 0 against Swansea. So they did it again. Two one against UPI. Two one against UPI. Yeah, we've had these obviously odd games where. With every now and again, it's not. It was two 0 against UPI, mate. We, two nil. Yeah, it was two 0 We had uh, we've had a lot of good games throughout the season. They're just very, very spaced out. It's not consistent and enough. Obviously, when we have lost as of recent, it's been hard fought games like against Bournemouth. Should have won that against Crystal Palace. Me and you watched that together. We're yes. going to do it on the live stream, but you know, BBC I played it. Let us watch it till about yeah. half, halfway through, did he? And then, yeah, and then we go to Barnsley tonight. After all that has happened, obviously, we have Blackpool. Somehow we lose that. You know, Blackpool everything... was an absolute misery. Yeah, and everything has just turned dead negative. It's like we lose one and then we lose so much momentum, we lose another and another and another. Yeah. It's like we're just in that consistent losing streak. We can't go on a losing streak. If we do that, we're going to get relegated into League 2. League 2, League 1. League 1, that's what I meant. Yeah. At this rate, mate, probably League 2 is where we need to play. I think so. Just yeah. build ourselves back up. Yeah, we've got um, Peterborough in four days. Four days to recover and try and smile again. At least it'll be a day match so you'll have a full light shine in your eye. Yeah. And um, yeah, we go from there and hopefully we can get three points. If not, where the hell do we go next?